been out on a patrol boat with the Ukrainian Navy. You can see we're just heading back into port. While we were out here on the Sea of, of Azov, we saw evidence of a, a Russian patrol boat um, following uh, another ship. The Ukrainians say that uh, Russian patrol boats are constantly following their ships moving out of this port. The Azov Sea, the Sea of Azov, is a, is a waterway that's supposed to be shared equally between Ukraine and Russia, but the Ukrainians say that the Russians have been restricting their ability to operate in, in the sea, to use their port for commercial activity. They say, in fact, since 2014, when Russia annexed Crimea, the level of traffic coming in and out of Ukraine has dropped by up to 50%. And for the Navy, it's been a huge hit. Their main base was in Crimea. They've obviously had to, had to lose that. Moving back to Odessa, they're now trying to rebuild their Navy, rebuild their ships, and also rebuild, rebuild their ability to defend their own coastline. Here in Berdansk, they are actually renovating a base here. The UK is helping with that effort, but there is a very real risk of uh, further escalation. That's why you've got Western powers meeting with Russia this week to try and, um, and, and prevent a crisis. But in Ukraine, they know the threat is real. They've been in a, in, a, in a conflict with Russia for the past eight years. And one risk is that there could be a, 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 new, a new escalation on the waterway, somewhere like here, where uh, the Ukrainians say they are determined to defend themselves.